I mean, you're like Seb's other dad anyway. I, mean, I know we've talked about it, but adoption is a big step. So I'll have a look into it and see where we stand. But God forbid anything should happen to him, you'd have to take him to hospital. You have no rights, you won't be able to tell him what to do, what not to do. You all right? Yeah, I want to be. OK, um, do you fancy a day at the scrap? Yeah, I could use that spare hands. Sorry, I'm busy. I'm sure you found a better pair than mine. Anything I need to worry about? Obviously not. OK, good chat. I'll see you later. See ya. I know when someone's not right with her. She doesn't answer her phone and you think she's got a problem? Yeah, three times I called her, Robert. That thing's glued to her hand. And she knows who was calling her. She's probably scared you're going to make her go up to the scrapyard. And what if it's about Seb? What? Are you serious? She heard us talking about adopting him, didn't she? So, you know, what if she's feeling pushed out? She loves Seb. She's not going to be jealous of a baby. No, but I... What? You think she wants you to adopt her instead? You're looking for problems that aren't there, aren't you? Perfect timing. Where are you off? Out. Oh, where? Does it matter? Well, if, if there's something going on? There's not. No problem at all, is there?